Hi guys, welcome back to Toon and Lee in Thailand and our infamous crayfish pond. Uh, we've put a lot more weeds in here now, these aquatic floating plants and the crayfish are absolutely love them, so do the fish and the snails and the, uh, and the little shrimp in there as well. What I want to show you, and it's just a quick one today, is this little blue box set that we've got here. Is, um, I just stole it out of our village house garden, it was part of our um, tower filter setup that I had there and um, if I just lift up here you'll notice that there's all little holes drilled in the bottom as, as if I used to have medium in here to uh, take out all the uh, the crap on the filter so in here I've separated the two little red crayfish that we've got I think they're called neon crayfish um, but since we put them in here a couple of days ago, one of them has uh, molted, so they've, they've shed their shell. The pre uh, since that, they're, they're, they've eaten it. Uh, but what we've noticed is, <laughs> and I wasn't aware of this, crayfish actually <laughs> grow their claws back. So it's not very clear at the moment. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go to Aquacam and pop the video camera in there again. And uh, so you can have a bit of a close up. He, he normally legs it though. But, uh, I'll try and chase him around and you can see it's the white claw it started to uh, clone itself and uh, uh, grow again so let's put it in there and you can have a, have a closer look hopefully that's going to turn out quite well if you didn't see our other crayfish videos we've set them up in a playlist so I think this is uh, the the fourth video we've done in the series um, we're basically hooked on it we we, we love them it's quite um, quite addictive growing crayfish so uh, we'll be uh, expanding upon what we're doing yeah the reason we've put these little red ones in here the red ones are a bit like a, a, a Jack Russell dog uh, small dog syndrome they're always picking fights on uh, on bigger dogs so these these two little red ones are always fighting with the uh, the Australian red claws which are considerably bigger and that's why <laughs> one of them lost their claws so uh, thankfully it's it's grown back we've unfortunately um, lost one of our brown ones well we've not lost it it's inside one of the red claw lobsters <laughs> uh, what happened they they ch they molted their their shell and uh, obviously backed into a, a, a pipe where there was a, a, a red claw or, or one red claw got in there and it couldn't get out so we've tried to separate these and uh, learning as we go along we've been learning loads offline and uh, other keepers so um, yeah it's uh, watch this space it's uh, it's very very exciting thanks for watching guys and uh, we'll see you again soon